recording. Okay. Welcome to the February 4th meeting of the Chaos Common Metrics Working Group. Um, if you want to add your add yourself to the attendees, that would be cool. I'm just going to type mine in. Seventeen. Okay. Happy birthday. Ooh, wow. It's so bizarre. It's like bizarre world. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> okay. So we don't have a ton of stuff on the agenda today because I think we finalized a couple of the metrics in the meeting that I missed last time. Um, so maybe we just start with reviewing the action items from previous meetings. Here I can, I can share my screen if that makes it easier. Okay, you should see the, um, see the agenda? Yep, I do. Perfect. So action items from last time. Uh, yep, I saw Matt G submitted it for release. So all of that looks done. I don't see any other action items from last week. No, last time we just, we really spent time kind of driving, like we actually spent time, you know how like that action item was solved in the meeting. So we actually spent time doing all of that just because we were under a little bit of time pressure because we knew that this meeting would occur after the date that Kevin needed. Yep. Totally. Um, okay. So we can also do reviews of uh, open PRs of which there are none and issues. Um, So we have this one. Uh. So this is our volunteer that um, is helping us uh, standardize across. He's working with Georg on that. So um, that's where that came from. Cool. So it sounds like there's probably nothing we need to do about that one right now. That's still active. No, I don't think so. Yeah, he's uh. working on that, so. Unless we wanted to weigh in on how we wanted to see the standardization. So he placed a, this exact um, issue in every working group. Okay. So unless we had a comment. Hi, Daniel. Oh, hi, Daniel. Hello, sorry, I was kind of stuck in the waiting room or something, and then I said, well, this is running, so. Right. <clears throat> Ready. Um, I mean, this all looks, this all looks reasonable okay. to me. Although, uh, I understand. I understand this because it says use underscores and then the example he gives uses hyphens. Or she, I, sorry, um, that's terrible. That they put is between metric name and image name. I don't understand what this means. Does anybody else know? Should I just leave a comment? Between, I was putting a comment in. Oh, okay, perfect. There's, I would say there's some discrepancy here. Is that okay in the comment? Yeah, yeah, that looks good. Okay. Um, cool. Anything else anybody wants to talk about that? Uh, no. I'm really happy that it's happening, I guess. Yeah, no, I think it's nice really that somebody's doing that. Hi, Kevin. Hello. Hey, Kevin. 
just going through the issues. So these next three are just metric candidate releases. So there's really nothing, nothing to be done there at this point. Um, so this one, new metric burstiness. Wasn't that? Oh, that, that can probably be closed. Yeah, I was just yep. gonna say, I thought we had that. We could maybe re reference the other issue, number 101. Just to keep them together. Okay. You said it was 101. Oh, there it is. Cool. So I will say thank you to the common working group. I've been going through the other working groups to kind of work down the list of PRs and issues and there's really nothing to do in common, which is great. <laughs> <laughs> um, but yeah, I mean, I think it's, I think it's important. I mean, you can't, you can't address all the issues, but if you don't, Maybe. if you don't think about them every, every couple of meetings, you'll just end up with a gigantic pile hmm. of, um, neglected oh, issues and they're, the they're years old <laughs> so, <laughs> which is i'm like oh my gosh it does look yeah. like we had a comment oh sorry i didn't mean to interrupt you um it does look like we had a comment on technical fork so i don't know if that was some, from someone who was in the community reviewing it no never mind no nope. just kevin pointing us to where we should look Um, and then these other three, uh, Daniel, I think these are ones that, that we were working on at one point. What's the, what's the status of, of these three, the, the new metrics? Um, yeah, from, from my side, I have not advanced any, in any of them for the last okay. month or month and a half. So basically, I assume unless here in the, in the, in the group, uh, you've been able to advance it somehow. I have not. Um, okay, cool. So I think any other is there a, a, look at? is there a reason we have the in discussion label versus metric idea label? The other working groups use metric idea. And I had, I looked at one of them and I saw that we had metric idea on them. And then Kevin, you had removed that label and put in discussion. Did you have a reason for that? Uh, for which one? Um, time waiting for a reviewer action. 88 is what I'm looking at. So if you just click on did I do that? I don't know. November 12th, 2020. I have no clue. Here's, here's what I think, since, since oh, you don't remember why you did this. Oh, go ahead. Of what I did before. Okay. I, I, think there, I think there actually is a, a progression of going from metric idea to in discussion. So I think it was a, it went from an idea to something like, yes, let's work on this. Okay. Yeah, that was my understanding um, after looking at this was that, uh, yeah, it's a metric idea when somebody's just like, hey, we should have this metric. Gotcha. And nobody's actually done anything, but this one, we actually have a Google doc for it, which to me, gotcha. so I, I kind of like the distinction between the two. I think that I kind of matches with the spreadsheet as well. Okay. This is helpful. Thank you. I, I can, this is helpful for the other working groups. Cause then as I see ideas that are actually in discussion, I can relabel them. Okay. Thanks. Um, so I was just going to look at some of these. So this one, I'm waiting for reviewer action is it's kind of started. We have some description, some objectives. I was just gonna look at the, just do a quick look at the status of the three of these. Should be exactly the same. Because when I opened <laughs> it, I, I copied and pasted, and then I was updating slightly the, the things. Oh, this one has some filters too. This one has some visualizations. Actually, this one looks kind of close. Mm -hmm. Is there 
the, my, my main concern probably is that I remember we were working like a month ago or a couple of months ago about uh, updating the vocabulary, specifically uh, uh, change, uh, oh. change the quest and so on. That probably is not uh, mm. here. Uh, okay. Let's just look real quickly at the other one. Time to merge. Okay, that one is that one is not made as much progress. Rick typed something so that it's in discussion. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Um, okay, so that's good. So we've got, we've got those those three, which we can um, we can come back come back to that in a minute. So let's maybe look at the spreadsheet for the progress on the current metrics. So we have these two under under in progress mm -hmm. with links to the issues, which is good. And time to merge is the other one. It's yeah, that row one. thirty-five. Yeah. yeah. And maybe maybe we do want to change the in discussion tag to match the vocabulary that we're using on the spreadsheet. So instead of in discussion, it could be, we could change that to in progress. Oh, I like that. We could also match the colors. I'm just saying. <laughs> you totally good. Uh, That's a good idea. I think metric idea does still have to remain a tag uh, because I, if I remember correctly in the past when we, we we were saying we didn't want to use the spreadsheet to collect metric ideas. Yeah. Yeah, I think that's fine because anyone can create a metric idea, and it could be it could be totally harebrained that maybe isn't something that we we put on the spreadsheet as considering. Um, I'll make I'll make the I'm hearing, labels. Yeah. I'm hearing a call for harebrained metrics ideas. <laughs> yes, we that's should do more I, of that. We need more <laughs> harebrained metric ideas. <laughs> Okay. Um, is there anything in particular that we want to talk about on the in progress uh, on the spreadsheet? Sorry, not in progress. Anything we want to talk about any of the metrics on the spreadsheet? <clears throat> okay. Um, I think. Release metrics for this cycle under review. Not sure who added that to the agenda. <clears throat> oh, Sorry, that was me. That was me. <laughs> I was just I was just sending us a link to the web page to just show that these are under review. Oh, okay, perfect. That Kevin had done all the work to get them <laughs> in front of people. Sorry. No, no worries. Is there anything? Is there anything we need to do here? I like the bright red under review buttons. It's very, very eye catching. Okay. Is there anything we need to talk about on this? <coughs> okay. Moving right along. Um, the last bit which I think is where we can go back and maybe talk about some of the other metrics that we just looked at from the issues is what, what do people want to work on next? Um, yeah. I, I'm, I'm late for the meeting, so sorry about this, but, um, and I have not attended the last one, but the question I have is, uh, is there any uh, goals for 2021 for this group in somehow that we can discuss or were already discussed maybe? This is no sense. Yeah, no, it totally makes sense. I also missed the last meeting, um, and I was trying to think if we had a like a goals discussion. I don't know that we have in the common working group. 
do the other working groups have goals and, and we just haven't done them here? Maybe D and I. Okay. Um, I, I would say that one of my, um, I went all fuzzy all of a sudden. Uh, one of my tentative goals would be um, that I think we should try to get a metric or two in the space category here because we don't we don't have any in that category. So I think it might be worth um, doing a couple there. And it looks like we have some docs created for some of these. Which I apparently can't click on. Oh, there we go. Okay, that's that's not super. Super helpful yet. <laughs> I hope I was hoping they'd be kind of like with Daniel's docs or just click on and be like, oh look, it's half done. No, no luck. Um <laughs> what I would say is is there anybody that wants to um is there anybody that wants to take on something in the space category and do a draft of the metric that we could review in the next meeting or the meeting after that. And it doesn't have to be one of the ones that, one of these two that's templated, or it could be. I think that events location one is probably the easiest one to do. I thought so too. Does anyone want to volunteer for that? Yeah, I mean, I can template it out. That's easy enough. Collaboration platforms. There is um, similar metric to collaboration platforms in DNI. It's it's like it's different. Never mind. Is this is that? Do we think that that collaboration platforms is just basically? Um, documenting all of the different ways that the community, that particular community communicates with each other. So it's just not really making a judgment on, like in the DNI one, it's more about the inclusivity of each of those or, or of the chat channel or chat platform. So is this just a collection of them? Yeah, I think it's just a collection. Uh, the answer is we haven't defined it. It could be anything. <laughs> If it's just a collection, it's kind of like events to me. It shouldn't be that hard. Yeah. But it's like like counting counting axioms or so, or we are thinking about to, has someone had a specific metric? Like are we talking like, oh, there are four collaboration <clears throat> is, is that the metric or something different? Maybe it could be, I'll be honest, activity I'm not, with each. I don't know. Yeah, I'm not sure that this is, I'm not sure if this is a metric the more, the more I look at it. I wonder if this was, um, I wonder if this was part of just like brainstorming, like we could have metrics for collaboration platforms. And I think this was the metric. result, oh, sorry to interrupt. I think this was the result of a, uh, I think it was a student project and I'm not sure. I'm not sure where it came from, but I, I believe it was the result of a student project. May I, may I share my screen? Uh, yes, absolutely. So, so I, I go and share my screen. So this is this is um, <laughs> an idea, let's say, <laughs> uh, that that came came to my mind when we were discussing about uh, this collaboration platform. Um, and the thing is. Uh, well, this chart is kind of telling us where kind of activities taking place, so where people are participating at in somehow. This is not exactly collaboration, but this uh, where people are leaving traces of activity in, a, in any of the data sources. And suddenly we see that in chaos, for any reason, we start we started having certain activity here. Well, Twitter probably because we, we started to track this. But there are others as IRC that may be starting there. But since that we have kind of a continuous activity in chaos for a while in some data sources as the red one, which is Git, 
and there are some others as uh, the green one where we started to have some email activity. So there is previous activity. So it's like a way of saying where people are participating at. It's kind of the space. And this is giving kind of a, an understanding of the size of such activity, you know, with the how big this is. Like, uh, you know, the, the, the orange activity is pretty similar to the green one, to the green one as the blue one, yellow or red. So this means that, well, organizations are kind of participating there. I don't know, does it make sense? That's really cool. I like that. I think that that's perfect. This, this, this is by organization. So the numbers that we have here, that's why this is so uh, uh, stable over time, let's say, the number, the different numbers. But we can have this at the level of events or at the level of people. So I don't know. Just in case may, this makes sense. Everyone. Yeah, no, that's really interesting. This is for the chaos community, by the way. <laughs> if you're here in the chat, in the chat. By the way, hello, Georg. I think I saw Georg join. Hello, good to see you all. You too. So the metric would be activity on collaboration <clears throat> platforms? Or maybe number of people on collaboration platforms. So what, what happens if we see in that chart like a high peak of number of people in certain data source. That means something, that something is happening in that space. Mm -hmm. <laughs> somebody want to take a shot at working on that one? And just take a shot at defining it? I suspect, here's what I suspect about this one. I think that we'll mm -hmm. start to define it and realize that there are a couple more metrics that are around collaboration mm -hmm. platforms that we'll also need to define, but I think Sometimes it's better if somebody just takes a shot at it and see what happens. I kind of start framing this and see what happens. Is the, uh, can you share the link to that visualization, Daniel? Oh yeah. Or did you already? Should be in the chat, let me Okay, so, yep, I see, thank you, no. sorry. I'm just gonna drop it in the mm -hmm. document real quick. Thank you. Um, Perfect. So the the other ones we had were the ones that um, that Daniel you were already working on, and it looks like maybe I wonder if what we want to do next is try to finalize this one, the time waiting for submitter action, because this one looks like it's it's in pretty good shape. We could. Time is it? We could spend some time on on it in this meeting if we wanted to. We could, if you know that there's some stuff that just needs to be changed, you could go away and change it and come back and bring it back into the next meeting. I would say it's just the the wording, the way this is explained, perhaps, just to be more coherent um, <clears throat> with the with the existing wording we have in other documents. Oh, I don't know. I cannot. I cannot paste my the, the the URL for the for the dashboard. I don't know why. So maybe someone can. Sorry. <laughs> uh, I'll go ahead and take a pat first pass at that collaboration platform. So by the way. Okay. Cool. Okay. What was the? Can you just tell us the URL? Maybe we can. Is it an easy one? The chaos sure. dashboard. Oh, it's it's in the it's in the chat, the, the URL. So it's just copy and paste, but I cannot paste for some reason. Oh, okay. Oh, you said it's in the chat. Yeah. I don't know. Oh, there we go. Which I have now clicked on several times as a result of yeah, it won't like I can't copy. Or yeah, it's been pretty, difficult oh, yeah, for me yeah. too. And now, now I can't close the chat window because everything's. Ugh. Well, when you share your screen and screen and Zoom, things just go kind of sideways. Um, okay, I'm not being helpful here. 
<laughs> it, it's already it's already in there. So oh, it's already in the chat. Yeah. Okay, good. Yeah. I'll, I'll stop <laughs> looking you. up stuff. Um, okay, so we have three good action items for next time. Um, is there is there anything else you want to talk about in this meeting? Anything else we need to do? Anything else you want to talk about? Okay, so let's work on the let's let's talk just briefly about the agenda for the next one, which would be February. Uh, 18. Thanks. So we'll do our standard, standard ones for the agenda for next time. And then um, we'll work on a couple of these. So I'll look at you. You've already created docs for things. I was um, even just while, while during this meeting, while I was kind of templating out the event one. I mean, there's just there's not much to it, <laughs> like, I mean, which is okay, I guess. Maybe I'm not thinking broadly enough, but okay. All right. So I think we've got. Got stuff for next time. I'm gonna put the agenda at the top because, it, well, I'm gonna delete this because I like to create it right before the meeting so that people can easily find the agenda. Um, okay, so I'm waiting for a submitter action. Let me just drop that link in here. Cool. Um, all right, is there anything, anything else? Um, yeah, quick, quick comment on, on my side. This is more of a, like a, a personal thing, but just that uh, I, I feel like a lot sometimes coming and going and appearing in the meetings and so on. So I have less and less time or I've, I've had uh, not that much time during the last month. And it seems that the next couple of months is gonna be like pretty similar. So just in case, sorry okay. about that. I'm not one to talk. I miss a lot of the meetings too. No apologies necessary. You are welcome all the time, anytime, anywhere, <laughs> any working group, you name it. And when you do join, it's always a bliss. Productive, oh. I mean. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. All right. Anything else? Are we are we pretty much done? I think we're good. Look at me giving everybody 10 minutes back. Ten yeah, minutes. I'll see you great, great global hero. <laughs> <laughs> All right. On that note, thanks everybody. Thank you. See you Bye. later. Bye everybody. Bye. Bye. Bye.